Hello, welcome back to my channel Sini's Primary Math. In this video, we are going to learn about perimeter and area of triangles and associated properties. Those who are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon to get my future videos. We know a triangle is a closed two-dimensional figure which is formed by three line segments. Look at the triangle ABC shown. Every triangle has three sides and three vertices. A base is one side of a triangle usually taken as a reference side for other measurements. The base of a triangle can be any one of the three sides, usually the one drawn at the bottom. Altitude. The perpendicular line segment from a vertex of a triangle to its opposite side is called an altitude of the triangle, also called height of a triangle. Here, the line segment AL is an altitude of the triangle. Since there are three sides, so three bases. Therefore, the triangle has three altitudes. The three altitudes intersect at a single point called the orthocenter of the triangle. The position of the orthocenter may be inside or outside the triangle depending on the types of triangles. Median. The line segment joining a vertex of a triangle to the midpoint of its opposite side is called a median of the triangle. The line segment AD is a median of the triangle. A triangle has three medians. The three medians intersect at a single point called the centroid of the triangle. The centroid is always inside the triangle. Perimeter The perimeter of a triangle is the total length of its boundary. Therefore, the perimeter of a triangle is the sum of the lengths of its three sides whether they are equal or unequal. If a triangle has three sides A, B and C then perimeter P equals A plus B plus C. Units same as length. Area. Area of a triangle is the space occupied by it in a plane. We can calculate the area if we know the base length and the height of a triangle. Area of triangle equals half base into height. It can also be written as area equals half B into H where B is the base not breadth and H is the altitude. As you know area is measured in square unit. Heron's formula for triangular area. If the height of a triangle is not known the formula half BH cannot be applied to find the area. Then Heron's formula is used to calculate the area of a triangle if all the side lengths are known. A equals square root of S into S minus A into S minus B into S minus C where A, B, C are the three sides of a triangle and S is the triangle's semi-perimeter. The semi-perimeter of a triangle equals to half of the sum of its sides. Easy to remember. Semi means half. Semi-perimeter that is half of the perimeter. It is normally denoted by the letter S in lower case. 
and is expressed as s equals a plus b plus c divided by 2. Learning Hope you are now familiar with perimeter and area of triangles. I know you are interested to learn more about triangles to make your concepts clear. Sure, I will be back with another video on this topic. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe and share this video. Till then, bye.